Hey all, um, I've been away for a few days, uh, having a bit of a break from the house, and I got in just now, and uh, I got lots of posts, obviously, you've been away for a week, you get lots of posts, uh, these are a few of the things that I bought, and they've come, there's the Oatmeal's book about dolphins and how to punch them in the mouth, XKCD comic book, so basically I've ordered these, uh, they all came, this is my Doctor Who and Weeping Angels t-shirt, that pizza didn't come in the post, I bought that separately, and these are quite cool, these are pencils that have got Harry Potter, uh, famous parts of the books written on them, so you can uh, have them if you're a proper Harry Potter fan, which I am. Uh, but this is what came in particular. These are Tour Beats by Dr. Dre, and I bought them from an, a website called Store Audio, store-audio.co.uk. Um, and thinking they were legit, because they were on Facebook, advertised at £40, and uh, uh, very excited, I thought, oh, these are a bargain. Um, I then found out that their website's actually on the blacklisted site for... Um, uh, Monster, Monster actually re realised that they're selling fakes and they blacklisted them um, and so this is um, a fake and even though the let me just show you on my computer even though the company insist that the headphones are purchased from an official UK distri di distri yeah, distributor sorry about that, can't speak properly today um, even though they insist they're purchased from a distributor this box came with uh, the headphones, and you can see that's from Japan. It was sent to York from Japan to York, and then sent to my address, which is on this piece of paper here. So they sort of, the middle person has failed to take it out of the box and just sent it to me. Um, and obviously they wouldn't assume that I would recognise the difference, but I work in a shop which does sell these for full retail value. And the first thing I can tell you is they do not have like an outside cardboard sleeve, which is what this one does have. Especially not with... You can't really see it very well, but when you have this in person, you can see that the, the, uh, the beats are sort of cartoony rather than a real life photo. I'm just going to open them up quickly. Oh, they look horrible. Oh, God. The, this is the, the smell of a fake. Um, they do smell very different to normal beats. Um, and the build quality on them is bloody awful. That's really bad. You can even see the B isn't properly lined up. That one it just about is, but with this one here, it isn't. Um, also, the leads, um, because it's from Monster directly, you'd expect Monster uh, as a cable company to have high quality leads, and these feel kind of like latex, like they don't feel very good in the hand at all. Um, yeah, I was very angry when I found out they were blacklisted, and Yet they insist. You've got an email here from storeradio.co.uk uh, that, that they're legit and they're from an official distributor. And when I asked who the distributor was, uh, they wouldn't actually give me a, a name. So now I'm just going to reply with an e uh, a quick email just saying, I want my money back. Um, They'll probably make me send them off, and they'll charge me for post and packaging, but I want that also reimbursed, because that's unnecessary. Um, but yeah, you can buy these officially for about 80 quid. Um, I got these for 40, so half the price. But it's I thought they were a good deal, because they were advertised all over Facebook. Turns out, um, they ain't. So, avoid storeaudio.co.uk, and uh, that's a fake tour headset. So, uh, if you need to compare... There you go, that's how you do it. Thanks for watching, bye bye.